as nurses that you need to keep your faith, you live a day at a time, and you always trust in God. If you're a parent, you know that you would do absolutely anything for your child, but this next story actually reverses those roles. And that's right, a Sherwood man in need of a stem cell donor, his perfect match, his daughter. Our Hillary Hunt's in the studio, and Hillary, the odds were slim for him to find a match in the first place. It's a pretty amazing story, you guys. Doctors at UAMS said he had about a 30% chance, but the transplant was a must to save his life. We knew what the odds were, and we knew that they weren't great. Like many of us, Paula Drager says she would do anything for her dad. It was just a prayer that a donor would be found. And when her dad, Butch, was diagnosed with leukemia... It's been a long journey, about two and a half, three years. ...that anything became a stem cell transplant. You got a 70% chance of not surviving. With a 30% chance to find a match, Paula crossed her fingers that she could be the key to a cure for her father here at UAMS. Uh, you're a match has to ask you, can, well, you know, are you willing to donate? I'm like, uh, yeah, you don't really have to ask that. <laughs> a no-brainer for Paula. So that would take her to my grave with me. But she said she wasn't the only sibling wanting to save her dad. You know, I just happened to be the one that was the match. Any of us would have done it for him, so. Now the two hold hands tighter than ever, realizing how truly precious this father-daughter bond is. The bond that they have right now, we have been told that Butch is cancer-free, but he is undergoing a maintenance chemo plan. Guys, back to you. Hillary, thanks very much.